But as you can see, even my harrowing songs have a happy ending. This is very rare in this business. Very rare in this business. Um, I want to uh, let you know I have a CD for sale. All the songs I'm singing tonight are on my CD. It's called Bill Poss, Hey, H-A-Y, like hey for sale, you know? And it's over here in the merchandise yeah. boutique. Yeah. If you'd like to check it out, I'd uh, appreciate that. I got 14 songs produced by Fred Eagle Smith. And uh, just me and my guitar, one, one microphone, one channel, mono analog recording, all the way to quarter inch tape. Yeah. Now, what that boils down to is, well, I think everybody knows that sort of analog is the old school sound versus digital, right? But, but what mono means, but what mono means is uh, that if you only have one speaker working in your truck, you can still get to hear the whole recording. Okay? Thank you. Yes. You're not going to miss the flute solo in the third song because you uh, didn't have that right speaker working. So, I noticed that Merritt, Merritt reminds me a lot of, uh, of Alberta. It feels, it feels kind of like Alberta here, because I guess because it's not as green as where I've been, but uh, sure it's beautiful here. Man, what a great place. Thank you. Um, thanks for making us welcome. I got one more song. I want you to know. Oh, also, I forgot to tell you. I wrote. I forgot to tell you. I wrote a book, um, and I. So much crazy stuff was happening to us on the road, and I kept telling all the people that I would run into about all the crazy stuff, and they kept saying, "You should write a book. You should write a book." And I know they were probably just trying to get rid of me, but I did. I wrote a book, and so uh, it's available also at the merchandise boutique there. Uh, Hanukkah. Yes, thank you very much. Our, our lovely uh, uh, Dutch. Uh, uh, what's it? A merchandiser? I guess you're a merchandiser. Yes, this is a merchandiser, and she's uh, showing you the book there. Uh, anyway, the book is all just just about what it's like to be on the road. We live on the road now. Now, uh, in our fifth year uh, on the road, this is our fifth summer in uh, in BC, and uh, it's a fantastic time. But it's a strange ride, folks. It's a lot different than I ever had lived before. So I invite you to have a look at the book. It's got uh, essays by me and by Tiff Tiff Jin, who's up next. And by uh, Robbie Folks had a nice. I don't know if anybody knows Robbie Folks. He's a fantastic uh, songwriter and performer. And so check that out if you get a chance. Um, Tiff Jen is up next, and then there's going to be a break, and then Fred Eagle Smith and the whole band will come out. And uh, for those of you who don't know who Tiff Jen is, I call her. She's fantastic. I call her the Eraser. And uh, what she, uh, I mean, she's just amazing uh, singer and songwriter, and she's real good looking. And. Uh, <laughs> And so she's an eraser because when you, when you get done with her set, you will not remember me at all. She will, she will, I, promise, I promise you, I do this every night. So I just, it's been nice to know you. I want you to know it's been nice to know you. And if you think that you might want to buy my book or my CD, you should write down and make a note, like a, maybe set a timer for the, like uh, an hour from now. But uh, anyway, it's been a pleasure to play for you. I want to assure you also one more thing, that if you think that I'm the kind of person who would just take the money from a book sale or a CD sale, just take that money and frivolously waste it like on drinks or food for my family. I, I want you to know, I want you to know that I will take that money and I, I'll put it to my son's education fund, okay? Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Now, thank you. Now, he's, he's being homeschooled. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, he's been homeschooled, and what we've determined is more than anything else, what he needs right now is a more qualified staff. And so we're working on that. We're working on that, and if you buy my book and my CD, that sure would help us a lot. Thank you very much. I'm Bill Poss. It's a pleasure to play for you. I had a dog. His name was Jack Rabbit. Throw him a stick, throw him a bone. He'd jump right up and grab it. Run like the wind, jump like a deer. There you have it. The best damn dog a man ever had. His name was Jack Rabbit. My dear wife named Big Nelly. She'd laugh so hard she'd shake like jelly. She'd send Jack Rabbit to the grocery store with a dollar in his collar and sometimes more. Well, I had a dog. Jack Rabbit Throw him a stick, throw him a bone He'd jump right up and grab it Woof. Run like a wind, jump like a deer There you have it The best damn dog a man ever had His name was Jack Rabbit Well, what you see, Rabbit runs there, get him, Jack You count to ten and he can bring it on back He 
Take him under his friend to a hollow log. He was happy to be there and knock my dog. Well, I had a dog. His name was Jack Rabbit. Throw him a stick, throw him a bone. He jumped right up and rabbit. Woof! Run like a wind, jump like a deer. There you have it. The best damn dog a man ever had. His name was Jack Rabbit. Where's my dancer? Why don't you get my front, bud? Come on. He's back there watching that kid playing video games, huh? He's supposed to be dancing. Come on. Hey! Well, my first boy, we met in Red Jim. He had a dog, a ticket, say, jump jack, give it. And that dog would grab it out of the air. He took first place at the county fair. Stand